Man, how brave would Link have to be? How brave would you have to be to do this? South Gerudo Cave, basically unnamed. Some truffles. Oh, yep, this is... This is, in fact, a cave, so I need to have some rocks with me. A lot of rocks. Of course, they're always going to give me some bombs. Thankfully, I got some bombs in the last cave. Let's go down the path of least resistance first. I love my two shields, by the way. My two shields are so good. Okay, what is... Stuff up there. We really... Man, we're back up to crazy amounts of bright bloom seeds. You guys weren't kidding when you say they hand them out like candy. Bombs, I wish were a little bit more plentiful, but I also get it. They're bombs. Whoa. I almost died. There. Whoa! What is that? What is that? Uh, I don't know what it is, but I want to kill it. That's the last thing I was expecting. What? Did I just kill a horriblin? I wish you guys could see my face right now. That freaked me out. Horriblins. Get a stick. Was he Gollum? He kind of looked like he seems like gob Gollum. Uh, we're gonna drop this real quick. I would like to do some spear fishing. Go! Sick. I'll kill the other one conventionally. You know, I just kind of jumped in here, not thinking about what I might have done had there been another Horriblin. Because that thing was aggressive. Did you see the way it came at me? That thing wanted to murk me. I would have been murked solidly, like... I would have been completely murked. I don't like this man. Riju's great, but she's about as good as a AI follower could really get. The best part about her is that she can block attacks. That's really cool, but on her own, she's not, like, she doesn't really protect you. Like, she doesn't take on a very active role. Uh, yeah, I'll take this. I think it's a bubble frog. Oh, I could have just gone around. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. Flint. Now I'm sneaking, man. I don't want to deal with no horriblins. Oh, there there's there it is. Okay, well. Black Horriblin. Yep. I am a photographer. I am a photographer. I need to... Actually... Nope, nope. I should be taking pictures of stuff. Yep. Yep. Got it. I... Ooh. I had one of those moments where I, I thought I panned the camera back and he was gone, and I was, oh, I was not okay with that. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Blue Horriblin. You know, if they, if they approach me, I can always... No, they know. Okay, watch this. Okay, he's right there. Oh, wait, what am I doing? I have I have gear now. One second, let me change my clothes in front of you. Just real quick. Uh, just because it's fitting. Get my stuff ready. Uh, I would like my shield out. Ooh, that's a big attack. Make sure the blue one isn't sneaking up on me. Uh oh. 
Oh, I got my shield out just in time. Uh, I need a long range thing. Where's my spear? That really nice spear I got. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yep, you get down. Get down, Satan. Oh, you're the easy one. Okay. The black one's easy. Good. Die. Uh, I don't need this. They're not that strong. They're just really scary. I don't like them. Uh, that's a lot of power. I don't need... I, that's, that's what I need. Okay. Whoa! Are you new? There's a... Where'd the third one come from? Whoa! Nice, Riju. Nice, Riju! Whoa! Look at you go! She one-tapped him! Way to be tactical! I think... That we are getting to the point... Soldier's Claymore Spear. That's pretty good. Uh... Oh, duh. We are getting to the point... I think where our resources are not, like, infinite, but I'm starting to feel really good about what we have. Like, I'm kind of- I'm not like, my inventory isn't very indicative of the stuff we've gotten, because I'm about to go to Grudo Town and buy a bunch of stuff. Is this where we started? Oh. For our troubles. Boom. Wait for it. Be a good shot. Oh, it drop. okay, it drops at an angle, but I need to keep that in mind. Because, like, I'm getting to the point where I'm stacking shields on shields. And we have a bunch of gems. I, I don't feel poor anymore. I just feel... I feel like I can buy anything. It just is going to take a lot of my anything. The anything that I have to exchange for it. Bones up there. I don't think we need to deal with those. There's nothing else up there. So now, we need to go back to the beginning. That's what I thought. Ho 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 ho. Point proven. We are... We are rich. Oh, I missed a chest. I'm glad I came back here. I was gonna ascend out of here. Long throw knight's claymore spear. It's power 28. That's not nothing. I'll drop this. I already have a rock hammer. Okay. I like going on road trips and just going places. I see something I want to go to, I'm on, I'm on my own, so I go there. And one of those things was this this hike, um, kind of between Idaho and... I think it was on the border of Washington and Idaho. And I, I go on this hike, and I'm just about to end it, and I, lo and behold, I see dunes on the horizon. I'm like, oh man. I didn't sign up for dunes, but man, do I want to see them. And it was getting, it was almost dark, but I was like, I think I can, I can make it. And I did, I got to climb on dunes. It was really cool. It was a unique experience. I, I've grown up in Washington state. So being in the desert is just kind of novel to me. I'd imagine it's like that. Actually, I know it's like that for uh, people who've grown up in like Arizona or even like Africa. I've seen some videos of people from Africa seeing and touching snow for the first time. And there, it's just something we take for granted. Like, people who live next to the beach, it's not special to them. But it's special to other people. And I think that's something that we need to appreciate, is so many things that we take for granted are the most magical thing in the world to someone else. Okay, I'm fine. And, I mean, from each... Person, each person has a, a different perspective, so whether they live or die, their world, the world that they've constructed in their mind, dies with them. And I think that go, recognizing that fact goes a long ways into respecting other people. Because even if, the, to you, their perspective's completely outlandish, and, to, and sometimes it's born of them being manipulated and having really a really poor, like, li having listened to the wrong people, but they 
they still have a world that if they didn't exist, that world would be dead. And there are people that they might like that you hate, but they are, this is a weird contraption. What do they want me to make with this? They are able to love people that you can't, and those people might be very starved for that love. And so without that person, some people will just never be loved. It helps you appreciate. It helps you appreciate the value of a human soul. Everybody brings something to the world. Though sometimes it's not much. You die. Actually, I'm gonna try to shield bash this. Hey, come here. Oh, I hate, I hate you. Yep, do it. Ow. Come on. Don't die, pal. Come on. You need to... You need to get some skills here. Or have Reacher do it for, it, for you. That, that also works. That is also something that can happen. Thank you, Reacher. Uh, you go, girl. Wait. Is that the ball I need? Hold the phone. Is that what I need? Go. Was that the ball? Oh, they were time bombs. Okay. That's not what I thought it was. That'd be cool, though, if they were carrying that. Die. The fact that I'm actually running out of area arrows is very concerning. Considering how much I rely on them, it's not good. And Riju becomes significantly less useful at that point. That moon looks very weird. Was the Great Fairy where the dungeon now is? I think it was. I think it was. So either she's here or, I mean, either she's here or she's not. Which, I mean, really, with the fact that there are two outcomes, that means that it's a 50% chance that she's here. That's how that works, right? Also, this is like fully explorable. And there's stuff here. Steering stick? Yes, I need that. Beam emitter? Got a chest. Radiant shield. That. And then grab that. Yes. That's how I want to do that. Also, the radiant shield looks very much like the goddess shield from Skyward Sword. Same color scheme and everything. It'd be kind of cool if there was another Gibdo Queen. Like, that was a common enemy. I always like it when games do that. That's like the best way to reuse enemies. Some games just do palette uh, Breath of the Wild. Some games just do palette swaps of the enemies you faced. Other games, as soon as you progress to a certain point, like the earlier bosses become common enemies. And that is always a cool feeling when you can see how far you've come that you're beating bosses like they were chumps. That just feels so good. This was definitely worth my time. Yeah, this was 100% worth my time. I'm going to be able to afford so many articles of clothing. Looks like there is a... Chest, I think? I can also see there being like a mini boss here. I don't entirely trust that. No, it's fine. What is it? What is it? Mirrors. Okay, not bad. Topical, at least. And could... Really, that had nothing in it? Okay. Whoa. Hold up. Hold up. We'll go in that in a moment. I don't remember the ceiling breaking during that fight. Okay, it looks like there's nothing on top of these. I would have thought on one of them they'd put something, but they really didn't. I was also... I wondered if I should have gone back into the dungeon. Like, maybe it changed, but... Huh, there's just an alternate entrance in here for some reason. Gray, and it's been deleted. There's nothing behind here. Huh. I wonder why they did that. 
I guess maybe because you can't take the the lift anymore for s some reason, but why couldn't you? Okay, well, now I need to get out of here. <laughs> what is happening in this corner? Look at this. Why? That's weird. If you walk into this corner, everything turns white. Uh, huh. I don't know why that would be. Are we reaching, we're not reaching the edge of the map because there are parts of this dungeon that are still further south. That's really odd. It's like I'm considered outside in that one little corner. Well, I guess that's glitch number one. Neat. Dragon's Exile is directly ahead, so if the Great Fairy Fountain exists, it's near, it's nearby. But I'm not, I'm not seeing it. It should be right here. Drop down a little bit, because the draw distance. The draw distance, I do think, is shorter in this game. It feels significantly shorter, which is fine. I'm totally fine with that. If it means that the game runs at full frame rate, I, I think it's a worthwhile sacrifice. That said, there will come a time where draw distance is a thing of the past. One moment. Boom. Have some flint. Uh, I can't use this. Get ready. I know I've already killed this one before, and this is technically farming. I mean, there's nothing wrong with farming, but at the same time, it's like, really? Okay, but yeah, I, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some, I'm gonna get some gear. Okay, Riju. I said Riju. Riju, get over here, you idiot. Oh, snap. Did I just kill myself? I think I did. Okay, heal a little bit. Get attack up while I do. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Boom. I'm okay. Oh, boy. All right. Huh. This should kill him. Slow. I didn't know he had that attack. Well, you learn something new every day. Reju, go again. He can do 360s. Okay, that attack is really good, and this is the second time I fell for it. Bye, bud. Okay. I've made a full revolution in the desert. I've put it to bed that the uh, there is no great fairy, at least where there was in uh, in Breath of the Wild. I do want to see what's over there real quick, because that's like a little pocket that has something in it. Uh, but after that, I think we're going to go do the maze. I think that's how I'm going to end off this recording session. That sounds really exciting. Go do the maze, and then I'll be able to buy some... Did I really... Did I really take damage from that? Okay. Whatever. Okay. Oh, and we even have... Ooh, we even have goddess statues or uh, Gerudo statues pointing at it. Color me intrigued. Yeah, there's something over there, and there is a goddess statue, or a, again, a Gerudo statue over there. But there's also something here. And these bones are everywhere. The, the upheaval has exhumed these monolithic corpses. And I'm, I'm guessing at some point we're gonna find out exactly the cause of them. There, there were, they were everywhere. I mean, there were, 
There were like four, four to six of them in Breath of the Wild. And now, they've just been pushed to the surface. Some of which, some of the ones we found were in fact buried. And now, with them, there are more Gerudo statues. They, we're on to something. There is something here. Oh, and there's a Korok Seed. One moment. Got it. Okay, those are a lot easier than I I have thought they were. Because every time I see one, I'm like, oh, there's going to be like five minutes cut out. But no, they're not that bad. Okay, there's something. They're pointing this way. There's another Korok Seed. And a Like Like. Okay, well, I'll get the Korok Seed first. Although I'll probably be under attacking the Like Like while I do. Okay. I only have five arrows left. Uh, that's not good. Especially when I'm about to deal with the Like Like and, ooh, that's what this is all about. Okay, yeah, shoot your attack. No other enemies. Oh, of course. Of course, of course, of course. Let's not accidentally hit that. He's stunned for a second. I'll deal with the other one. Ow, 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 ow. There. That was a big attack. Okay, can we fight now, please? Nice, nice, nice. Cool. Okay. That's done. We get more rewards. We're just, we're just dripping in them right now. Give me the chest. Another Gerudo shield. I'm gonna... Uh, how do I want to do this? Drop. I want to drop this, actually. Pick this up. And use that as well. I don't, again, I don't know if that's actually doing anything. Only time will tell, well, only time and you in the comment section will tell. What? What is this? Watch out, Reju. Wait, what? Am I crazy? Um, try out one more time. Ah, it worked. 